The new update of ACPT version 1.0.153 includes numerous improvements. One notable improvement is that we can retrieve option page meta fields more efficiently using the dynamic data picker in the Bricks page builder. Data saved on an options page is considered global, meaning it's not associated with a specific post or page. This allows the information to be displayed on any page across the entire website. We have created these option page meta boxes and fields, and we'll explore how to preview these fields on the front end of our website in various locations. Let's take a look at the footer of our website and examine how the rendered data appears. After examining the rendered data in the footer of our website, we'll proceed to the Contact Us page to observe how the same options page custom field appears. As we can see now, this is the same email address, location, and phone number that we created on our options page, which is displayed consistently across the website. One of the significant benefits of an options page is that it allows the customer to conveniently manage all changes to their business information, such as phone number, location, email address, and staff. This information can then be dynamically incorporated into various pages of the website. This means that whenever any updates are made to the details on the options page, these changes will automatically reflect throughout the website, reducing the need for manual updates. That provides a brief overview of what can be achieved with an options page. However, there are various use cases for an options page that one can explore. So, let's begin by creating a basic options page. Once you click on the options page, you will see a notification that states that there are no option pages created yet. To create a new option page, simply click on the button located on the top right corner and add a new page. with a menu title of Company Information. And a menu slug of Company Underscore Info. We will select a random menu icon, which is the image of a building. And a menu position of 55. As for the capabilities, choose the options that best suit your needs. For this video, we will leave them as default. And we will add a few descriptions of this page for tutorial purposes but you leave it blank as well. After you finish, click Save, and wait until changes are successfully saved. Once the required changes have been made, the page will automatically reload. In case the page doesn't reload, feel free to refresh the page manually. Once you refresh the page, you will be able to view the option page that we created previously, named, Company Information. You will notice that there are no meta boxes created yet. One way to simply click on, create the first one here, while the second one involves going to ACPT and selecting Option Pages. Here, you'll be able to view the registered option pages along with their respective details. Additionally, you can view the existing meta fields created. When you click on the Create button for meta fields, you will be redirected to the creation page where you can proceed to create new meta fields as per your requirements. Here, you can choose from various field types to create suitable meta fields for your option page. For the purpose of this example, we'll create four different fields, company name, address, phone, and email. However, it's important to note that you have the flexibility to create as many fields as you need, set the appropriate field types for them, and even incorporate conditional logic as required. You can rearrange and change the order if necessary.
Great. Now that we have assigned meta fields to our option page, let's proceed to fill in the relevant information. Now that we have the contact information for our fictional company, we can start using Bricks Page Builder to integrate this data into our website footer and contact page for display. We add basic text on our footer and then select the dynamic tab to get the data that we stored in option page in ACPT and render it at the front end. We duplicate the basic text and modify each fields that we need to reflect the respective meta field we created. Since we created four meta fields we will copy four times and show the company name, address, phone and email fields respectively. Click Save and View on front end. We follow the same steps and show the meta fields we need on the Contact Us page. That's how you use option page and render the data in the front end using Bricks Page Builder.